special unboxing of a very powerful and mystical thing marked fragile it's paper there's a cassette oh, 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 oh. put that there and there oh, oh, oh. more cassettes oh geez geez i need some help with this meg he could be the to tape liver no he's meg see you're trying to be a film guy but you know it's just yeah, if he's put over it. Just can't yeah, get the stuff now, I know, I know. Here we go. Many tapes. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Hey. Don't forget to get my good side. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is one hell of a mess. <laughs> this is yeah. Just leave it for the magical cleaner will come in on Friday and do everything like normal. <gasps> it's a keyboard! Ta -da! Yay! That's cute! The Amstrad! There's lots of um, no leads, but. So. <laughs> Wow! Yeah, arcade joystick. Yeah! Newspaper. Yeah. It's cool, eh? Oh, we've got a manual. And some magazines as well. Yes, Amstrad Action Magazine. I remember that. I used to get that magazine and I, I used to get uh, Amiga action, but I had an Amiga after the Amstrad. Okay, here we go. Mm. Name dropping. Yeah. Caressing <laughs> it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we're nice and gentle with the motor. Here we go. We'll be playing Oh Mummy in no time. I'm sorry, Chris, don't overwork. Yay! No big crap on the monitor. Yay! Yeah, there's a bit of crap up there. Look at all the tape marks and needles left. You see, it's. <laughs> Just can't get this, this, this is the kind of thing that Michael should clean. He's very meticulous with that sort of thing. Alan Stewart basically designed this based on the idea that, well, aesthetically he designed it, he didn't make it, design it, design it. Um, so that it would resemble a real computer like you would see whilst checking in at an airport. That, that was his idea. He didn't want it to look like a pregnant calculator, which was what he described the spectrum as. So. So you put a cassette in there or something, too? Uh. Make sure that we've got everything. Oh. The monitor it's seems to be good. It's warming up. Nothing worse than your brown wire not getting where it should be. Hmm. Look at all the games. Our manual. Wow. And even some copies of Armstrad Action. Let's see. 8th of May, 1986. Jesus. This was like a gaming magazine. It was really popular. You'd have like game reviews. Ooh, page 48 is the review of Batman game. Have a look. Okay, so now we're about to try again. Okay. Yay! Ah, excellent. Now we've got an LED light. Check out the man. Hey, hey. Yeah, look at this. We should get Michael through for this because Michael would get excited. Right. Let's shout Michael over. Wow, the exciting moment of truth. Yeah, you ready? Look. Thanks to Neil's clever clogs. We got, yeah, 
<laughs> You're excited beyond belief, aren't you, Michael? Right, let's see if I can still remember how uh, how you would do something. That, of course, let's get the uh, old mummy. That's a that's a classic. We could. Uh, I've no idea if you if you had speakers or not. I think we did, but I, I think we didn't. I think they're just built in. We'll find out if there's no sound. But oops. Go. Side one. Yes. Rewind it first. Yep. So oh, look at a cassette player. A mouse? Yeah. So no mouse? Yeah, it's a moose. Oh, that's a, that's a, moose. <laughs> a mouse. It's got a moose here. A mouse! Yeah, yeah, there's no operating system, there's no icons or anything. That's that. That's yeah. Windows. Yeah, that's a joystick. Cool, that's it. Right, okay, so now we don't play it. Yeah. You gotta get the code in right, I think. Yeah. Right, uh okay, jeez. Is this ready? Yeah. Play, press play, and then any key. Oh that seems too easy. <laughs> press and play. And key. It's turning. I remember getting that a lot. All right, we're, 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 we're going to come back to this. Yeah. Starting to play, and then you should have well, loading welcome one block one come up eventually. Take five minutes to load. Yeah. Wait, this isn't plugged in. Uh, I think you could use the keys, though. Yeah. I would assume. I guess if you plug in the joystick. You see smoke. Oh my god. Oh my god. So how old were you in 1984? Minus. I was born in 98. Oh, little puppet. Oh. This is what you were missing. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I really missed out. Oh, the beautiful sound. <laughs> so this was my childhood computer. So it's amazing to have this back. Quite, quite handy that it's got a wee handle. It's actually a very attractive 8-bit computer. Yeah. You know, it was quite clever when they that they came up with a monitor rather than just uh, mm -hmm. much easier to convince mums to let kids get this computer. That was the best joystick. So I guess this 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 game will have minus. Oh my God! What's going on there? What are you, what are you doing? Jesus Christ! I was trying to take a video, but you talked. Right. A Z. Left. Right. That's the, the complex constructions for this game once it's finally... Uh, I guess it would do if you plugged it in. Ah, uh, this loading sound sitting here. That was the anticipation when you and your friends were sitting waiting excitedly. This is the last time you used a, a, like, a regular joystick like that. Plus Amiga. Yeah, <laughs> a million years ago. Well, I use joystick when I play flight simulator. Yeah. So. Oh yeah, you're gonna be hipster chick. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we've been waiting four minutes so far. <laughs> <laughs> but I think it's nearly there. It's surprisingly compact. Though. Yeah, it's an attractive unit, isn't it? Sorry. Yeah. I mean, Commodore 64 was cool, but it was a, it would get a wee bit grubby because it was creamy. Mm -hmm. <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, no. No, are we there? Oh, <laughs> no. All right, okay, we'll try another one then. Okay, so I guess, I wonder what you would do. <laughs> oh, mummy. Uh, let's see if you can figure out how to reset the computer, Michael. And we'll try a game that I know loads very quickly called um, Roland in the Caves. A legendary. Of course, the, the original artwork for this has, has, has vanished. Our, our seller has kindly given us a, a printed cover for the. Yay! <laughs> And we're now loading Roland in the caves. Mm. Have you ever felt as excited in your life as what you about, do right now? What about Postman Pat? Yeah, I've never never played that. <laughs> it's 
this was before um, Bioshock Infinite. Oh, not interested then. <laughs> oh, oh. This is... <laughs> Killer Pete. Everyone, Killer Pete. Everyone loved Killer Pete. Yay, here we go. Yeah. Whoa. Keeping your fingers crossed. I mean, these tapes, how old are they? 10? 35 years old? Yeah. So, they might be some corrupted data. <laughs> <laughs> like, so, as a, it's like hamster um, sawdust inside someone. <laughs> Oh, that's what they came packaged in. Okay. Amstrad action, Michael. Yeah, you can learn some code. Yeah, that's right. They would have in these magazines whole pages of code that you would type. Uh, and then you get a little game. game. Uh, it takes wow. you literally about five hours, and if you made one mistake, it wouldn't work. Like, is it worth it? And there's no way you could just move the cursor to the bit where you made the mistake. You'd have to delete all the way back. It's kind of cool. Though. Yeah. This is only. Like, I don't think anyone ever did it. Uh, there's fifty-six lines of code. It's not bad. <laughs> yeah, you'd be fine. Well, you should tape up and down <laughs> Counter slowly taking over. This is making our childhood a little bit less glamorous than yeah. to make, I think. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Can't say I'm impressed. We, we, we built this up quite a bit. What do you mean? I did. <laughs> Wait till you get the music. Pretty. Did you play it when you were about 30 years old? It's finally loaded. What do you mean? I was only seven or eight. I don't know how kids had the patience. See, this is why all the kids nowadays are so impatient because of <laughs> YouTube back in our day, waiting this long for one game to load. I mean, we really appreciated patience. You could really reflect on the many spiritual aspects of life. Mm -hmm. Oh, you see that? Oh no. I thought there was a bit of a flicker, but it's actually just uh, the interlacing of the old TV. Oh. In the frame rate of the phone, making it look like it's creating these banding waves. Oh, but we don't see that at all, folks. It's just totally solid. <gasps> Yay! Wow. Yeah! Pretty cool, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, I guess we'll get we'll get ready then. <laughs> so Z and sorry. We are. In this game you play Roland. Oh. Oh shit. Oh ah! <laughs> <laughs> he didn't last Let's see if this Good job. Okay, you gotta try the joystick. Oh, I think, I think, I think, it I think it's the key only. Oh, yeah, but <laughs> no. Oh, oh, oh Jesus! Oh, oh, oh. Lifted the buttons again. All right, here we go. Try again. Life was very short in this game. I remember. You got arrows. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Jesus. How can he be so hard? <laughs> That's first level. It's just, a, it's just a psychotic pterodactyl chasing you. Well, I think it's, uh, I think it's your turn now, Meg. No, that's okay. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> here you go. What? Z and that key. How do I actually play it with Z and what? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, Z and that. Yeah, there's instructions. There you go. 
The longer you hold it, oh yeah, you get you see the power bar up there, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So if you want to do a little jump kick to just tap it. <laughs> <laughs> wow, what a leap. I don't know, Michael, do you think you you, you here we go. He's <laughs> 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 horrible. Oh. Oh. <laughs> this was like for Tom trying to escape his virginity. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> ah, so. ah, Tom, Tom, Tom's not a virgin. He works very hard with us. He's made love to most of the props that we have. So it's... <laughs> Here we go. Roland. It's stuck in the knot. You know, this is hard if you, Michael's like a nuclear scientist. <laughs> and, 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 and unlocking the mysteries of this game, it's like... It's too much. The whole time I had this game on the Armstrong, I was never able to get out. Of the first level? No. Oh dear. Yeah. So folks, I hope you've enjoyed this wonderful video. Featuring Michael and his nemesis, the pterodactyl <laughs> from that terrifying game. The beautiful Armstrad CPC 464, back.